What's up guys, welcome to Blake's Garage and another Totally Tubular Two Minute Tool Time Tuesday. Today we are going to talk about the OBD-11. Let's go. So you guys might be saying to yourself, what the heck is an OBD-11? Don't you mean OBD-2? Well, that's exactly what I thought when I first checked this thing out. So these guys actually sent this to me, uh, OBD-11 did, and what it's for is it's for your uh, your VAG vehicles, so your Volkswagen Audi group, you know, this is an Audi S3, this is a 2017 Audi S3, and what we're gonna do is a couple modifications that we can do very quickly from this tool. So I'm gonna break it down, I'm gonna show you guys some of those features that you can do, and uh, yeah, let's jump in the car and do it. So this is what it looks like, it's the OBD-11, it plugs into your OBD-2 port. So that on this car is right down here. This tool does require the use of an Android phone. So I actually didn't have an Android. All I had was an Apple. I picked this phone up for I think like 40 bucks. It's basically just a cheap little phone so that I can install the app. Hopefully soon, I know they are working on it. Uh, they are going to be making an Apple app for the iPhone, which would be great because, well, if you're like me, that's what you'll use. But let's go ahead and open up the app. So once you have the app installed, basically you can go through here and you can actually scan the car for any problem which is really awesome. Um, the other features that it has are under car. Make it really simple for you. It's really cool. There's a bunch of applications on here that enable a bunch of features that your car may or may not have. So for example, you got the basic settings of the transmission. That's really neat. You have the uh, mirror dip. So for example, my car did not come with mirror dip. So I can program this in, use 10 credits, which I think this thing comes with 200 credits. Um, on the basic version, you can get the Pro, which comes with more, um, and you can actually unlock those features. This is a huge one, brake pad replacement. So normally you would have to get a VAGCOM or something like that to replace the rear brakes. So that one is super easy and that is really, really nice. Uh, you have the auto lock feature, the LED license plate lamps, sound actuator, uh, oil temperature in the DIS, which that's really nice. I'm gonna have to enable that one. Oil service reset, which you can already do from the car. Um, daylight running lights off with handbrake. When you really wanna turn off traction control, that's really cool. Lap timer, inspection service reset, headlight washer, air recirculation, needle sweep, and hill assist. So, I don't know, that may have been way over two minutes, but as you can see, those are a lot of different functions that we have in there. I want the mirror dip on this car. It should have came with it from the factory, but, well, they just plain did not enable it on this vehicle because this is the, uh, the premium and not the prestige. So, we are now going to enable that function on here. I'm gonna load up this app. We use a couple of credits. It's all we have to do right here is we gotta select the value. We are gonna turn that on, click and hold this. Now you can see that it is working. So we know that it's doing it right now. And it said that it is successful. So now, well, we're basically gonna try the thing out. So let's see if it works. I'll show you it work now. So this did not happen before. I put it in reverse. Now when I do that, you can see my mirror tilting down to the ground, which is great. We can back up a little bit, and then when we put the car back into gear and drive away, it's gonna go back to the normal position. Okay guys, so as you can see, that is definitely a totally tubular two minute tool time tool. I'm stoked for that. I just enabled some stuff on my vehicle that it, well, it didn't come with from the factory. And it was super easy. This is probably my favorite feature in the app. It's the brake pad replacement. Um, you're able to release the rear calipers on this car because of this stupid electronic parking brake, um, you actually have to use the application or VACOM to do so. So this is gonna make that super easy. Basically all you have to do is just hit this button, hit open, close, anything like that. And uh, then, well, it's gonna recalibrate it and all of that stuff. So very, very cool. Um, yeah, I really like these features on this thing. If you guys have an Audi or Volkswagen, um, it can do a lot of other things as well. There's uh, certain features that it can do to the traction control system, it can do, um, it can do lots of little little tweaks. You can even do long coating on this thing. So it's very, very cool. I think it's a totally tubular two minute tool time tool. If you guys wanna pick one up, I will leave a link down below to this bad boy. And yeah, you can, uh, well, you can work on your own Audi or Volkswagen, which is always nice. So we will talk to you guys soon, later, and wrench on. Let me know in the comments if you like this tool, and we'll see you tomorrow.